Hey Pisces Collective, let's jump into your reading. Welcome to the channel. Welcome back. If you've been here before, let's see what Spirit has in store for the Pisces Collective. Four cards for Pisces. Will you listen? Third group today to get that. There's so many things I want to say, but will you hear me all the way out? Will you believe me? Something to say. You can't make it up. There's something I really want to share with you. I'm waiting for the right time to tell you. Okay, so somebody wants to talk to you. We have it's on. I see you looking good and moving on. I don't care who you're talking to. I'm better and I will compete for you. Taurus got the same card. You could be connected to a Taurus. Some of you are dealing with an air sign. Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. With all this, I have something to say. You're so special. You're truly divine. I've never felt energy like yours before and I can't get enough. Overall energy is finding myself. It was time. I went within to find myself again. I need to figure out what I want out of life. I need space. So some of you, this person took some time away from you to figure themselves out. And now they want to come forward and have a conversation with you. There's something that they want to tell you. And it looks like it might be that they want back in your life. Let's get some tarot. See what spirit has to say. To you about this person, this connection. And you want to get some advice and some messages and all that good stuff. Please give me some messages for the Pisces Collective. Let's see what's on the bottom of the deck. Ace of Swords. There's that communication right there. Libra, Grace, Gemini. Like I said, will you listen? Three of Pentacles. Wow. The last group they got, will you listen? Got the Three of Pentacles too. Queen of Swords. Libra, Grace, Gemini with Capricorn energy. This person wants to have an open, honest communication with you about getting back together. They want to work on this connection. This could be somebody that um, you work with. Could have been a work romance. Um, and it's possible somebody could have put you in a third party situation. I hate, I hate saying that, but it's possible. It's possible. They want to work with you, though, and they want to have a conversation about that. Show me um, something to say, even though we already see. Six of Pentacles. Yep. And the Emperor head. There we are. Aries or Taurus for some of you or somebody on the cusp. This is somebody who wants to have communication with you about a commitment. The emperor is all about a traditional relationship. And the six of pentacles is about equal give and take and generosity. This is a person who wants to take care of you. Okay. This is the father figure. This is divine masculine energy. This is what they want to share with you. They're waiting for the right time to tell you that they want to come back and actually offer you more than they offered you in the past reciprocity this time around okay we have it's on i see you looking good and moving on i don't care who you're talking to i'm better a lot of them have leveled up financially both of these cards are level up financially this is a boss the emperor and the six of pentacles is a boss too okay you know taurus is, is, is a boss all right so we got the high priestess with the high priestess and the lovers while well, two major arcana so it's either a cancer or pisces or a gemini you're connected to with it's on this person feels like they are holding in right now what they feel for you, but it's a, there's a lot of strong feelings that they feel for you. They feel like you're the one for them. You are their cosmic plus one <laughs> with the lovers, okay? So somebody could be 26 years old. I don't know, or born in 1962, I'm hearing. Somebody could even be 62. All right, um, so yeah, this person wants you to know that they have very deep feelings buried for you, but they want them to come to the surface now. They want to compete for you because they feel like you're their prize. Look how he's picking her up. Like, I won, she mine, right? They want to claim you, I'm feeling. They want to claim you now. Show me you're so special. You're truly divine. Yes, you are, baby. They, get, they have you as the sun. This person is very attracted to you and they feel like they are so in love with you. You make them happy. You make them want to celebrate. Somebody's birthday you could be significant. Some of you are connected to a Leo or a Cancer, I'm feeling, or somebody on that cusp. Cancer, Leo, cusp. And then we have the hangman. Pisces, this is your energy. So some of you, it says they never felt energy like yours before. They can't get enough. I feel like some of you could have called this off. It's possible you broke up with this person, but they're still in love with you. Finding myself. Knight of Wands. Mm-hmm. They've been out here just trying to figure out who they are. Seven of Cups, mm -hmm. exploring options, playing the field, but now they want to come back to you. Yeah, I feel like they know they messed up. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Scorpio, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Let's get three of these and see what else we want to say. I 
up in spirit. Show me what else this person wants to say to my Pisces collective. Ace of Cups. There's that new beginning they want with you. Another water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. They want to make a love offer to you. Three of Wands. So this person is just waiting, planning, being patient. Could be an Aries or some of you could be on a Pisces, Aries. Cause injustice. They want to match the efforts. Compromise. They're willing to work with you and be fair now. They could even want to marry you. They could be thinking about proposing to you. Bottom of the deck. Look at that. The Ten of Pentacles. They want a family dynamic with you. Generational wealth, marriage, family, everything. Some of you are not expecting this. We got the Tower and the Fool, Aquarius. Um, Aries and um, Scorpio energy with Virgo energy. Yeah, this is going to shock you. Pages four, some long delayed communication is coming in. Let's get some cards from this deck here. Hidden secrets. So what's the hidden secrets? Healing. Wow. Finding myself. Where's the card to talk about them healing? Then we have a card talking about healing. I guess it's just finding myself. Yeah, it says um, releasing, purifying, and cleansing. But this person has been going through some kind of healing. Fantasy, daydreaming, imagining, and fantasize. So they're thinking about you. They're fantasizing about you. A lot of them are looking at you, either they are watching you in person or on social media. We have distracted at the bottom of the deck. Sidetrack, change, and delays. I just told you the page of um, swords was there. There's a delay. There has been a delay in communication, but they want to come forward now. Okay. They, they were sidetracked by something or someone else. And it could be other options with this here. I want to reach out for you now. So they want to they want to reach out. They, this person is missing you like crazy. I miss the old you. I miss us. Mm -hmm. Let's get some advice from spirit. Wow, I see somebody got you on the brain. A message for you. I'm thinking of you this very moment. Your love fills me with light and I love you. So this is what they want you to know. Somebody else got that. But um, that's that. On that. Like the video. Subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Leave me a comment. If I didn't already say that. And I'll see you all when I see you all. Peace, bye.